That was a weird experience. This is the first time I've actually went back into a place where people aren't wearing masks. And I'm not wearing a mask. It was Trader Joe's. I'd say it was it was freeing, but also strange. I'd say like, well, for the demographic of people that shop at Trader Joe's, I'd say like 20% of them are still wearing masks, but most of the people were not. And it's just very interesting. It's like, we can see each other's faces again. And it just made me realize like how huge it is for people to be able to see your face. So I went back into work today and today's the first day at work that <laughs> I haven't had to wear a mask either, um, except for the first week that I was there. But then I got COVID and then everyone had to go back to wearing masks. So shout out me. <laughs> but it's crazy how much is communicated to people just by being able to see this part of your face. I mean, your mouth tells so much about you. It's crazy. It's, cra it's crazy. I I I'm just, I'm thinking about like the psychological just deficit that has happened to people in this pandemic just from just from not seeing people's faces you know from not having full human contact in a community the way that we always have and it's just interesting i don't know i don't really have anything like concrete to say about it except that it's just weird like just going back in it was it was refreshing it's so nice but just strange hope you guys are doing well check out my new cut by tyler <laughs> Featuring the new cut by Tyler Sue. <laughs> hope you guys are doing that. Hope you guys are. Yeah, hope you're doing good. <laughs> I'll see you soon.